The story of Sergei Pomonarenko. And did he really travel through time? The story of Sergei Pomonarenko is one of the most famous time travel stories, around which it raised a whirlwind of unsolved questions to this day. Sergei Ponomarenko appeared in Ukraine in 2006 with a passport dating back to the 1950s, and the man did not know where he was or what time period he was in. One of the main themes of science fiction is the possibility of time travel, either to the past or to the future, something that has generated countless philosophical discussions about the possibility of time travel. One day. However, some people have claimed that they have actually traveled through time. Among these cases, the most famous of which is the story of Sergei Pomonarenko, the hero of today's story par excellence. The controversial and intriguing story of Sergei Pomonarenko dates back to April 23, 2006 in Ukraine. That's when the policeman approached to help a man who seemed dazed and confused. The confused man was asking about a street that did not exist, and the man was wearing elegant but old-fashioned clothes. According to the policeman, the man presented identity documents issued by the former Soviet Union dated 1950. His name was Sergei Ponomarenko. Faced with Sergei Pomonarenko's suspicious behavior, the policeman took him to a clinic where a psychiatrist interviewed him and filmed his responses. According to the doctor, the clock stopped every time Sergei Ponomarenko entered his office. Sergei Pomonarenko confirmed to the psychiatrist that he was going for a walk to take some pictures only on April 23rd of the year 1958, when he suddenly saw a rather strange flying saucer, and everything changed out of nowhere. The time traveler argued that the evidence of his veracity was in his camera, which was not sophisticated. So they checked the images on his camera, and what they found stunned everyone. Firstly, the camera film used by Sergei Ponomarenko appears to have been discontinued in 1960, and it was inexplicable to explain how well preserved it was, because the material it was made of could not last more than 20 years. The pictures taken by Sergei also showed the old city of Kiev where it was possible to see the old buildings of Kiev. A picture of a beautiful woman and a picture of Sergei himself dressed exactly like the one he was wearing when he was found on April 23, 2006. But the most surprising thing is that one of the images revealed the flying saucer, or UFO exactly as it described it. Without being too clear about the next step in the investigation of the supposed time traveler, the psychiatrist decided to send him to rest, but Sergei Pomonarenko never showed up again. Surveillance cameras at the clinic caught Sergei entering the room, but he never left. The room's windows were closed, and yet he disappeared without a trace, adding to the controversy surrounding Sergei Pomonarenko's story. Thank you for watching. Please don't forget to like and subscribe.